This is Carrie Horn presenting the 5280 Home Social Media Plan for Integrated Social Media. Let's start out with the executive summary. 5280 Home is an ancillary publication of 5280 Magazine. And just to give a slight overview on 5280 Magazine, the magazine maintains the leading position as Denver's top regional publication. It has a subscriber base of 47,000 people and a distribution of 85,000 people. It's the largest distribution of any magazine in the Denver metro area, including local and regional titles. The magazine has an established brand and a loyal readership. It's 20 years in the marketplace um, this year in 2013. And over the past two years, 5280 Home um, has gained momentum and increased frequency. The publication in 2014 will publish four times with a three-month newsletter or time life um, each publication. In next year, 5280 Home will also look to make advances to become an industry market leader and the voice of the Denver home market. And one platform we will use to do this is um, its social media, including Facebook, Instagram, and later Pinterest. The target market and competition snapshot. The target market of 5280 Home is affluent homeowners in the age range of 35 to 55, skewing slightly female. Um, and a sub-market is the industry professionals. These target markets will look to 5280 Home to define trends, seek out and showcase unique Denver homes, and spotlight new products and find industry talent. Uh, there are two magazines that directly compete with 5280 Home, Colorado Homes and Lifestyles and Lux Magazine, pictured to the right. Um, Colorado Homes and Lifestyles um, has a linked Facebook and Twitter account, so content is the same and not unique. Um, and Lux Magazine is a national publication that posts to national fan base, so um, I think there is an opportunity here to corner the local market. Um, also, um, our target segmentation, um, the age range, 79% uh, of adults 30 to 49 use social media networking sites, and women specifically have a higher interest in Facebook, Pinterest, and Instagram, um, according to the Pew Research Center. So we'll use that to our advantage as well. Strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, threats, and trends. Um, 5280 has deep-rooted community ties uh, that will serve to create strategic partnerships within the community for 5280 Home. Um, 5280 editors are respected, trusted, objective, established. Um, and so we'll use that um, to our advantage for 5280 Home. 5280 Home is new to the market, whereas Colorado Homes and Lifestyles has been in the market uh, for 30 years, for example. So event sponsorships um, will need to convince folks that 5280 Home is here to stay. There's an opportunity to use 5280 Home Editor, pictured to the right, Cheryl Myers, as the face of the 5280 Home brand. We've seen success in 5280 Magazine using our food editor to brand our dining coverage. Uh, so we'll use a like tactic um, when I get further into this presentation uh, to be able to uh, really brand 5280 Home with a face. Uh, there's a threat because social media is a very time-consuming endeavor and there's a small marketing and sales staff for 5280 Home. It's the same marketing and sales staff used for 5280 Magazine. Um, so there's a, a question whether um, we'll be able to dedicate enough time to really make these mediums successful. There's a trend in 2014 for image-based social media. So we'll take advantage of Facebook and Instagram um, and, and that trend and, and post as many pictures and make these mediums really image heavy to take advantage of that trend in 2014. Marketing and social media goals. Um, goals are to create awareness for 5280 Home. We want to expand the 5280 brand um, and let people know that there's a dedicated shelter magazine called 5280 Home. Uh, 5280 Magazine has been writing about home for the last decade. We want people to know that we now have this dedicated publication. We'll create a strong industry voice um, through our strategic partnerships such as the American Society of Interior Designers and um, Architects as well. Um, we want to increase 5280 home newsstand sales and newsletter subscribers by converting followers and fans um, and leads into loyalists. On the social media side, we're going to create a loyal social media following that engages um, and has connectivity. We would look to also surpass the competition in number of fans and level engagement on social media in 2014. Um, and pictured to the right, you see the start of the 5280 Home Facebook page. Tactics include promoting 5280 Home content on a daily basis. 
Uh, to the right, you'll see pictured a blog posting uh, from 5280 Home Content. Um, it's a DIY decor idea. Um, we'll promote content like this to our fans and our followers on social media to um, show them what kind of content you'll find in 5280 Home. Um, on a quarterly basis, we'll do client giveaways. Um, we'll work with our advertising partners to get um, giveaways like Room and Board. Um, we've done, had success with 5280 Magazine um, promoting a 20 days of giveaways contest and, and uh, we've had success in generating leads from contest entries to um, newsletter subscribers. Uh, so we'll look to do that same thing on 5280 Home social media. We'll also post behind the scenes pictures from editorial photo shoots. Um, we'll do po party pictures and also ask our fans for submissions as well. Um, and we'll repost those submissions on our own social media sites for 5280 Home. We'll look to create partnerships to gain access to listservs. So we'll ask our partners to post our information on their social media sites to reach our target market through different outlets within the industry. Um, we'll also ask them to post events and when the publication is on newsstands to really um, make our reach as far as we can through, through those partners. As far as analytics, um, we will analyze the reach, frequency, and traffic using Chartbeat. Um, we'll monitor popularity and conversion rates to the website on a weekly basis, um, and then we'll record um, that data monthly. Um, for influence, we'll monitor fan engagement with Facebook Insights and Statagram. Um, we'll, do, we'll report these numbers on a, mar on a monthly basis, um, and on a weekly basis, we will have a digital meeting that will include staff to discuss um, success and failures and needed tweaks. Um, for conversions and transactions, we'll tabulate posts that inspire click-throughs to the website and to newsletter sign-up um, so we can make sure we know why people are, are signing up for those newsletters and what, what creates that, um, that lead. Um, and in terms of sustainability, we'll look for um, to really understand what our fans want um, and identify significant increases and decreases. We'll um, promote um, fan surveys and polls to really see ask our our fans what they're what kind of content they're looking for um, and that's how we'll kind of analyze that sustainability piece as far as implementing this plan uh, the first step towards implementation includes a detailed timeline and communication with both editorial and sales staff um, we'll look to become a thought leader in 2014 um, and we know that entering the social media scene uh, means monitoring our competition and, and what um, their strengths and weaknesses are as well so that we can utilize and um, emphasize our own strengths. Um, the marketing department will also ensure internal communication with the circulation department to determine a return on investment and non-financial gain. Um, and of course, we'll look to um, analyze our data and really determine if our data, if our um, goals are being met or not and tweak um, and tweak what we're doing in order to make sure we're successful. Um, so that's a synopsis um, of the 5280 Home social media plan. Thanks so much for listening. Really appreciate your time.